this is a condolence rant for director Tony Scott. He made Top Gun and Days of Thunder with Tom Cruise and with Denzel Washington, Crimson Tides, Man on Fire, Unstoppable, The Taken of Pelham 1, 2, 3. Yesterday afternoon, Pacific Time, Tony Scott did some people will consider unimaginable. He committed suicide by jumping off the fence at Thomas Bridge. I downloaded a story off Yahoo News that he had inoperable brain cancer. Some people would consider suicide as a sin. Here's this uh, question. What if you had an inoperable condition? How would you make your li last days on earth? Do you want to do it in comfort? or in pain. I'm not attacking religious leaders or people who believe suicide is sin. Here's m my answer. Why don't you walk a mile in their shoes and see how it feels? What if you had inoperable brain cancer? Do you want to go out in dignity? Or suffer? Agonizing um, pain? I'm not going to chastise Tony Scott for his um, option of committing suicide. He felt like he didn't have any choice. And he didn't want to feel like a burden to his own family. Because the cancer could ravage a person. He felt like jumping off the uh, bridge could solve his problems. Will Tony Scott rest in peace because you earned it and you don't have to suffer anymore? This is Roy Toomey. Junior from Dagsboro, Delaware. P.S. I wish we would find a cure for every form of cancer so that the individual does not have to resort to suicide as their final answer. Here's my message. I believe it's time to do extensive research on all forms of cancer. Like throat cancer, brain cancer, bone cancer, so we don't have any Tony Scotts in the world in committed suicide.